Brett Podolsky's dog, Jada, was sick, and he couldn't figure out why. His vet recommended that Brett make Jada's dog food himself, and suddenly all of Jada's symptoms went away. This moment sparked an idea. Brett partnered with his friend Jonathan Regev, and the two created The Farmer's Dog. It's a business where owners can get healthy, customized dog food shipped right to their door. Here's more on their journey as part of our Small Business Spotlight. I could just tell like your level of integrity and your care for other people. I was like, I don't, I don't know what it's going to be. I need to come up with a business idea and make this guy join me in it. I think it's uh, saying so. that for the TV. <laughs> I'm Jonathan Regev. And I'm Brett Podolsky. And we are the founders of The Farmer's Dog. I think the, the biggest benefit of having a co-founder is also having a confidant and um, somebody that you, you can duplicate your efforts, somebody that can do things better um, in some areas than, than you could yourself. The Farmer's Dog is really just like the brand we wished had existed for our own dogs. And when it wasn't there, we realized there was a, a lot to improve and we decided to do it ourselves. Jada was sick for like two years. I tried every food on the market. A vet recommended that I tried home cooking for her and all of her symptoms disappeared. And that made me realize that it wasn't Jada that was sick, it was the food that was making her sick. There were pretty interesting and alarming things about pet food that really made us question whether it would be healthy. We discovered the difference between pet food and human food more often than not is very simply that they're using ingredients that would strictly be illegal to sell to a human. The reason that's even possible is because the, the, the heat and the processing that they do to this food basically kills any potentially dangerous bacteria, but also of course, any great nutrients. This is our, this is our turkey recipe. Uh, it's really simple. It's just meat and vegetables. At the end of the day, the big difference that you're gonna get using a kitchen that we have versus using like a typical pet food cooking facility is safety. And that is of the utmost importance to us. Like we know that our food is going to be treated no differently than how all human food is made. You're interested. Good sit. We don't hire people to tell them what to do. Everybody comes here with their own expertise and something special, and we want them to come here and feel the power to contribute that. For us, the best thing we could do is just let them do their thing, you know? Yeah. If you don't have an environment where people can speak up, where something can improve, I think that creates a potentially dangerous environment where you're making decisions far removed from your customer. And I think that was something that took some learning for us. Building a business is obviously, there's a, there's a lot of struggle and there's a lot of responsibility on your shoulders, but at the end of the day, we know every single morning when we come into this office that we're all we're really trying to do here is to make as many dogs healthy as possible.